Hi everyone, about a minute on why Samsung's new nuclear power ship could be a real breakthrough. A few days ago, Samsung Heavy Industries, along with Denmark's Seaborg Technologies, announced they'd finished the design phase for a nuclear power ship that could have up to 800 megawatts of electric output. This is a big deal. Um, the design calls for two to eight 100 megawatt compact molten salt reactors to be installed on each of these power ships or power barges. Um, the compact molten salt reactor is is inherently safe it can't melt down like the light water reactors that we're using now um, so that's an incredibly important part of the the whole story here the other part is that the world is short electricity and particularly uh, cities in Africa and Asia and this is the key part I just looked this up something like three quarters of the world's population lives within 50 kilometers of the ocean so if Samsung and Seaboard can perfect this technology and deploy them at scale and shipbuilding and uh, other companies like Thorcon have shown, that's an American company that's also trying to build nuclear power ships, have shown that shipbuilders are the ones that could deploy nuclear reactors and do them very quickly. So uh, with so much of the world's population living close to the ocean, if Samsung can get this design and ramp it up, they could deploy these power ships all over the world. They would uh, be able to provide carbon-free electricity to developing countries and developed countries alike simply by pulling them into the harbor and connecting them to the grid. I've seen power ships myself. A few years ago, I was in Beirut. Uh, the Lebanese government had, had uh, leased two power barges from a Turkish company. They were providing a couple of hundred megawatts to the Lebanese grid, but they were also heavily polluting. They burned fuel oil, and the pollution was uh, was astonishing, in fact. Um, so this is there are many reasons why this Samsung announcement is so important, and uh, uh, it is indeed very promising. Okay, follow me on Substack, robertbrice.substack.com. Thanks a lot. See ya.